Thailand Outlook. สวัสดีครับ Welcome to another exciting episode of Thailand Outlook. The News Digest program broadcasting from Radio Thailand FM 88 and also online at nbt.prd.go.th. I'm the Chang with Dutch it. Today we are diving into delicious exports, exploring partnerships with a focus on sustainability, and celebrating a sport that is both fierce and deeply tied to our culture. Get ready for a show that blends business, social consciousness, and just a dash of good old-fashioned competitive spirits. Now let's start our show today with a story that is all about Thailand's tasty treasures. The Ministry of Commerce is on a mission to make c h a n t a b u r i Province the undisputed king of fruit exports, especially to China. We're talking massive deals for durian and mangosteen. You know, think billions of baht. This is a win-win. You know, Chinese buyers get quality fruits, and our farmers get better prices. But this is about more than just money. You know, with quality controls and official certifications in place, we're building a reputation uh, as a reliable supplier of top-notch produce. And have you ever tried durian or mangosteen from John Tabori before? And if you love those fruits, stories like this matter because it ensures those high standards are maintained. For our second story today, let's talk about building a tourism ministry that benefits more than just visitors. Now, the Tourism Authority of Thailand has teamed up with Tourism Cares, a U.S. organization championing sustainable travel, and this shows a commitment to tourism that really protects our environment and gives back to local communities. TAT has been pushing initiatives to get Thai businesses on board with green practices. And why is sustainable tourism so important to Thailand? Because it is not just about trendy buzzwords; it's about protecting the places. And uh, traditions that make us unique, so uh, travelers keep coming back for years to come. And for our final story today, we are going to be looking into the world of Muay Thai. The public relations department recently hosted a star-studded event that really promoted Muay Thai as both a legendary sport and a symbol of Thai culture. We're talking demos, international ambassadors, and uh, big plans to make Muay Thai a global phenomenon. Now, Muay Thai is not just about competition. You know, it's about discipline, artistry, and a deep connection to Thai history. And promoting Muay Thai is also about boosting sports tourism and uh, supporting the many businesses connected to the sport. We are also thrilled today to welcome Assistant Professor Pete m o n s i v i k o n who was involved in the Arts and Muay Thai events. We're going to be discussing the significance of Muay Thai beyond being just a sport. And why the government is committed to promoting it as a form of soft power. Okay, why Muay Thai? I think the answer is obvious. You know, Muay Thai is a Thai tradition, Thai heritage, Thai culture, been with us hundreds of years, hundreds and hundreds of years. So it is uh, it is natural that we select Muay Thai to be our lead in the soft power. Uh, not to mention that Muay Thai has the word Thai in it. So Muay Thai, Thailand, it, it 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 is you know automatically Thailand because of the name as well, and so you know, uh, and Muay Thai is a sport that you know everyone can get involved. You don't need to buy an expensive car, motorcycle, whatever to get involved in Muay Thai. You know anyone can access. So this is why we chose Muay Thai. And from juicy deals for our farmers to sustainable tourism to the power of Muay Thai, it's clear Thailand is not just sitting still. And remember, being informed is about seeing the big picture. How our economy, environment, and cultural heritage are all connected. Thank you for joining us, and I will see you again on the next episode of Thailand Outlook. I'm Kajang with Dot Jit. สวัสดีครับ With its over 600 million citizens, ASEAN holds immense economic and social potential. So the region can mobilize its capacity into a positive standing on the international stage. Thailand is working to connect with ASEAN. Thailand is engaging in mechanisms and activities that bring the people of ASEAN closer together, as well as to better connect the bloc to the wider world.